All right, let's do it. Let's do it to it. Whoa. Coming out of the gate. What you need is a Geist Flame for his Neonate. That would be great. Oh, doesn't even have a Neonate. That is great. That is great. <laughs> I think it would be great. All he has is a dagger and a tree. And, like, nobody to pull it out of the tree. And he's playing this Dumposaurus Rex. Oh my god. <laughs> bow. That looks like the kind of dog that would just say bow. Not even bow wow. Yeah, just, just bow. Just bow. Are you going to offer up a trade? His feral ridge wolf for your Selhof occultist? Yes, I am. Make that dog bigger. It's crazy. Oh, oh, just his. Yeah. Yeah. I just wanted to see his face again. So he can't even do anything. Nope. Are you going to play a Galvanic Juggernaut or Burning Vengeance? Galvanic Juggernaut. This doesn't do anything yet. I was just curious. Are you gonna play Skurzdag Occultist? <sighs> yeah, I think I just play the Juggernaut, and then next turn if I draw land, I can. Oh no, I can't. But either way, I think I just play the Juggernaut okay. and start getting offensive. On the other hand, I could play the. Either one of these would be good, really. Just any card in your hand, yeah. basically, that you can actually play. Okay, yeah, but which is the best? I want to say Juggernaut. Yeah. Yeah. Seems like a fine time to play. And also, do I even attack here? I could no. very well attack. You could very well attack, but do you want to? I could time walk him to trade his dog for my juggernaut. Yeah. And then yeah, I think he you would either take whatever or... Yeah, just attack. Yeah, who cares? It's two points of damage. Maybe he'll let me kill my guy. Nope. Big jugs. Big jugs. Man, that's a great juggernaut. Four for five, five. I think that's correct. You know, you, like you play the most threatening cards first, and then if he deals with them, then we just scale down. Yeah. And oh, have... but he could take it. Don't forget that. Oh yeah. Gut is traitorous, blasphemous, treasonous. <laughs> Yeah, that would be kind of lame if you took my cultist. If you took your cultist? Yeah, but while I was still summoning sick. Oh. Oh, he's just... Yeah, I kind of... Oh, what's oh. really happening? He's attacking for massive damage. It's unfortunate. He's attacking for 11. His wolf is just barking at you. Hmm. So what do you do on your turn? Maybe I should have played my Burning Vengeance and Dream Twist. Yeah. Maybe. I mean, I think you play the Burning Vengeance now. Yeah. Are you just dead? Wait, 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 wait. You might not even have time to do that. What are you talking about? He can pump his dog for four. So that so that moon heron hits you down to four. No, he can't. Unless he has a brimstone volley, in which case he pumps it once and then. Mm-hmm. Alright, well, let's see if this works. Yeah. Cutting it close there. Yeah. It's too bad. Well, we'll see. I mean, I'm pretty sure we could pull this out in game three, even if we did lose, but. Yeah, it's just too bad. Like, I guess I shouldn't have attacked here. Yeah. Because like, I didn't know that he has traitorous blood. Traitorous blood. Like, uh, him taking my only blocker removed me with a blocker because now it yeah. doesn't untap. That's actually pretty inconvenient. Okay. 
Huh. It isn't really. Alright, well, he got you down to. Well, that sucks because you're at three. <laughs> He's re-equipping it? Oh, he's no, playing, he's playing another, another one. That doesn't matter, though. Dream Twist, you got an island, an island, and a rune catcher. <laughs> Alright. That is very good. Is it? Well, I don't have enough mana to make it great. Like? Um, I can kill his instigator gang, but I have to kill his moon heron this turn. Yeah. Um, that well, will I mean, untap it's, my yeah, guy. Yeah, it's gonna untap so. your guy. <clears throat> um. Yeah. I think I just pass. And yeah. Then flashback, think twice. I mean, that's actually good because he's gonna attack with his. You're gonna have to. He's gonna equip a bunch of stuff to his Ridge Wolf, I think. Mm -hmm. Or maybe I don't even know if that's that's not cost effective. But like, you could probably just trade your his Ridge Wolf for your Juggernaut just to soak up damage, and then you can block his Instigator Gang. With your occultist. Oh, this oh is... balls. I forgot about that shit. Um. Does that kill me now? Pretty sure. You will die. Oh, what a boner. Yeah. Um. All right. Well, we'll see what happens. <laughs> yeah, that's really unfortunate. Yeah, that was. That like... was a... Misplay. Yeah, super misplay. Okay, so... Do you have another dream twist? Yes. No, I do not. I'm just wondering if you should play think twice or dream twist. Uh... No, I have a thing that flashes back for three, but not for two. Okay. So I think I should flash back think twice. Although this could get me. I think you should flash back three silent, twice. whatever. Yeah. Yeah. I mean. Do I just die? I'm pretty sure you just die. <laughs> because if I block here, he can pump, and then I'm dead. Yep. If you could flash back two things... I can't. Which you can't, then you'd be okay. Alright. Well, you're what? sure you have nothing? Like, I think yeah. you should think twice or dream twist. Unless you're 100% sure. Yeah, like, I have two guys flame, two think twice, a desperate ravings... This, like, I'm pretty sure, and I'm low on time. Okay. Here, well, let's see really. what those two cards were. Oh, crap, there we go, my hand. Alright, whatever. That's too bad. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't have anything. Yeah, you didn't have anything. Okay. Well. That's really unfortunate. <laughs> yeah, like, if we just would have cast a spell. Uh-huh. I almost, like, I was gonna suggest that you should do it on your turn because, not because, like, I had forgotten about a stupid werewolf, too. Yeah. But, like, just so that, like, you couldn't have drawn an answer to, like, you shooting down his moon heron because he had no cards in hand uh -huh. at the time. And if you would have done mm -hmm. that, then we would have cast a spell. But all right. Well, anyway, I like, was too uh, busy talking about something that ended up not mattering. So maybe this. In for what? I don't know because I wanted to play this last time. Oh, I like the Iron Smith. Yeah, I don't need the Iron Smith.
This is cool. I'll be able to play first this game. Yeah, that's neat. Uh, yeah, I really don't know what I should take out for it, though. You sure you want to run that dissipate? I mean, he's shown that he has a number of bombs and stuff, you know? Like, just yeah. seems... I still just don't like that cultist. This cultist? Yeah. You just don't have that many things to sacrifice. No, I don't. And, like, I don't like the juggernaut either. No? No, because he has traitorous blood. Like, both of these are both actively bad. Both of these are bad. bad against traitorous blood. Yeah. Um, the juggernaut is actually not horrible. Yeah. I could see taking out the cultist, but on the other hand, he has that thing, like I said. Like, if we can just get this into play before he gets traitorous blood, How? It's, then it's good. Well, if he hasn't drawn it, like, it's not, you know? Yeah. But, like, I don't know. I, I'm just gonna do this. Okay. Like, I think that that's Pitcher fine. Pitcher and Devil's kind of bad, too. And he has got the Hobrick. I'm gonna do this. 